this is SoftSpy SE Anti-Spyware by Pareto Logic. This would have to be probably the most popular and uh, definitely the most promoted anti-spyware software on the market. Uh, this is the first screen you see when you start it up uh, and it's got your um, menu here on the left. Uh, so it tells you what version and uh, everything you're using here. Uh, so if you go to the general settings tab you can um, tell it to launch at startup and you've also got options to say to launch without scanning or launch with scanning. So that's um, that's a good feature there. It does the automatic updates like all the other software um, and it has your default home page there and search page so that if other programs try to change that it will stop it and leave it uh, set as this default search page. Uh, the other thing, if you scan settings, this is all your your settings, which most of the other pro well, some of the other programs have actually. Um, browser hijackers it does registry, active processes, host files, system folders, and you can also select individual uh, specific folders there. So there's some good options there. Uh, it's got scheduling, so you can specify that as well. Uh, backup list. This is if you want to restore a backup. You can specify your own um, executables or applications for it to ignore if you know that they're not spyware. Um, then it will tell you the results of your last scans. So if I click on the start scan button, it'll it'll just keep scanning and um, we'll see what this program picks up. So the scan has finished now. It um, scanned over 562 objects. Um, and um, all your running processes, it found 36 um, objects. Uh, one registry key, two registry values, 33 files. Um, so looking at the list here, um, a lot of them look like um, tracking cookies. Um, and then a, um, another file here. So if uh, you can do a usage report as well and you can um, view details so you can right click on each um, item and find out more information about it and you actually go to Pareto Logic's website and they will tell you more information about that particular item. So if you've used uh, SoftSpy SE um, and you like it or didn't like it, uh, put some comments below and let us know what you thought. Thanks.